Fort Tabor Park is the city of New Bedford's newest park and one of its largest. Located on Clarks Point at New Bedford's southernmost tip, this 47-acre park offers something for everyone. Sightseeing, picnics, or exercise, the historic fort, completed in the mid-1800s, is a picturesque symbol of the city. Surrounded by beaches and a walking bike path, Fort Tabor Park is a popular attraction. The park's proximity to the sea on all three sides offers visitors sweeping views of Buzzards Bay and the Elizabethan Islands. Stereo binoculars mounted along the paved walking and bike paths allow visitors the opportunity to view close up the 270 degree panorama of the city's outer harbor. Clocks Cove, Buzzards Bay, and the myriad of fishing vessels inbound and outbound from New Bedford. The park features important historical landmarks, as the site's former use as a military reservation dates back to the American Revolution. An earthenworks fortress was the original Fort Tabor. Though long removed, its exact location is known because of the detailed map, which was rendered by Captain Henry Martin Robert, superintendent of construction for the stone fort which replaced it. Captain Robert later gained fame for his definitive book on parliamentary procedure, Robert's Rules of Order. The outbreak of the war between the states, the stone fortress was only a small number of courses in height. The concerned citizens and whaling merchants of New Bedford with the support of Mayor Isaac C. Tabor rebuilt the earthenworks battery and equipped it with cannons. On May 11, 1861, it was dedicated and named in honor of Mayor Tabor. 